when, when I take a passage and I memorize it, I usually will like really pray about it, especially the night before and be like, what do you want me to memorize the next morning, Lord? Um, which has really helped in some situations where I didn't know the, what the next day would bring, but he would go, I need you to memorize this verse. I need you to memorize this one. We had to memorize um, Isaiah 55 and um, some verses in Isaiah 55, and it talked about how the Lord's thoughts are higher than our thoughts, and that when His Word goes forth, it doesn't return void, but it accomplishes what He sets out to do. And um, I had looked at my pastors and was like, what do you want me to memorize tomorrow, Lord? And he was like, you're gonna memorize that one tomorrow. And the next morning, um, a mom of 10 kids who are under the age of nine, um, mostly disabled children, um, she passed away, the mom. And it was very difficult. She was a very good friend of ours. But it was so encouraging when I pulled out the verse to memorize and I hadn't read the last part of it. And being able to actually memorize, this was my word, this was my plan, and it's gonna go forth and it's not gonna return void. These kids are gonna grow up. They, I have a plan for their life, regardless if their mom's around or not, because I am their Heavenly Father. Um, and it's not gonna return void, it's gonna accomplish and it's gonna prosper in what I sent it to do. And so just praying over the verses before I do it um, has been something that I really enjoy doing before I memorize them. My name is Abigail Mangello. I'm 17 years old. I've been doing the National Bible Bee for about six years. 